So weird. This is our first time bringing Coco to the rock pool. I feel like she is well seasoned in the um, world of beach and stuff. So this is her first time gonna be at a lake. She be scared at the beach because she doesn't really care for the waves. She likes the waves, she likes to jump over. Where are you going? Come on, we're going this way. She likes to jump over the waves. But anyways, here we are. So this is my park, my park that I like to come to. I don't know where I shut off at, but we haven't been here in four years. We're here now, but I brought the dog. This is a place that we can bring him. It is nature. This reminds me of Michigan. Like Atlanta don't have a lot of this kind of stuff. Like Michigan, you go to the lake, you go to so many different places. Everybody got a boat, you know. Look, my baby, she excited. What'd you see, mama? What'd you see? You saw something? What'd you see? That's called nature, mama. That sound like a bucket rain. Yep. Lord Jesus. You know the way? I don't care, but the thing is, is we gotta carry all this stuff. Okay. Well, at least we can put her and him in it and move fast. So we have to park up there to be safe. Right. Go down the trail and we'll show you guys the rock pool when we get down there. Coco say, see you in a minute. Blow a kiss. Mwah. <laughs> Jonathan had to clean his shoes. Yeah, yeah. You don't know I'm about to blow it up in a second, little girl. We putting on some uh, bug spray we got from Mexico. He does not speak English. Hey, hey, no beber un agua. It's muy sucio. Hey, Ew. sucio. I'm gonna strap you to the pole. Look at you, you look like a dirty mutt. But you purebred. Hey, boy, purebred, 15K. Don't try to steal my dog. Because I got a gun. Hey, hey, come on. Come on, boy. Swim boy! Oh my god! Pepe! Come here, boy! Good boy! Good boy! Oh my god! I'm so proud of you, boy! Oh, good job, boy! Come here! He said, That's enough. He said, I'm gonna head out. Nope, you stay over here if you wanna be free. Good job, boy! Good job! Come on, come on, let go. Go, boy. Go. No, not that way. Not that way. This, ooh, this way. Come on. Here, boy. Oh, God. <laughs> He's excited. You go, boy. Woohoo! Is it deep? Look at his eyes. Yeah. Is day, boy? I got you. I got you. Don't worry. I got you, boy. I got you. 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 It's okay. I got you. It's pretty. I know. The water be a little. I know you got excited. Oh. Right away. I'll you Come here. Come here. You don't got to go in the deep end. You want to get in the floaty with Coco? Oh. 
It feel good, don't it, boy? You want to walk over there? To the waterfall? I'm so proud of you. Come here. You can't go up there because I keep falling. Get it, Coco. The only time you'll really be able to play in mud. Good. It's relaxing. Go. Go. <laughs> Look at her face. <laughs> Coco say, ugh. Fancy. All right, that's the end of our extravaganza. We are heading back to the car. He said, meet you, peace you. Fail, but of course, because Jonathan never records anything, that's why y'all never get to see me anything. Y'all always see, y'all always see Jonathan and Coco with all these beautiful photos and I get none. I have no photos, no video footage. So if I was to die, my daughter ain't gonna see nothing. All she gonna be able to see or here is my voice on these YouTube tutorials or videos. That's it. Cause he doesn't get any, anything. Um, long story short, what I was trying to talk about was I just fell. So this place used to be like a beach, you know, kind of, but they don't have beaches here in Georgia. I still have dirt on my back. <sighs> so the water has came up and taken over all of that where it used to be um, sand. I know in a few years, and I said this before, when we used to come here, I already said it, that th that was gonna happen. Because when it would rain the next day, if we came after the day it rained, the water would be so high, but it would go back down. But now it has taken over the majority of the sand. Now it's pretty much mush and like i don't want to say a bog but like sinking sand so as we're walking through it your feet is going into the mud like you're sinking all the way down i don't think i got the video of my first shoe going in there jonathan had to dig it out and it was full of mud so long story short we enjoyed ourselves it's been a long time coming. We finally get to take Coco. Jefe loved it, which I love that he loved it. 
because he never gets in the pool at our house but i could tell he wants to go swimming you know so he got in there and he actually swam to the middle like trying to follow me it was the cutest thing and then he saw that he uh that uh he couldn't feel the floor no more his eyes changed his eyes went from like <laughs> to <laughs> and i know that feeling i know that feeling all too well so i hurried up and tried to grab him or whatever and so yeah that's the end of our trip at the what we used to call the rock pool and old friends kids or well, grandkids used to call it the rock pool. It was a place that we all would come in fellowship and joy and laugh and joke and eat and just chill for hours and hours and ride down the rock. They called it the rock pool because we used to ride down the little fall. They had the fall, the little waterfall. But at that point, the fall was a, um, full of rocks. <laughs> but here we are. We are at the passageway. This means we're almost home. This is where we're going to wash our feet, put our shoes on. All right. Kevin, relax.